Hello, everyone. Hold on. There we go. Hello, everyone. This is Sock Dead Jug Fan 001 here. So, uh, I've been slacking on a lot of things. I th keep thinking I'm getting stuff done, and I'm not, and I'm sorry about that. Um, but yeah, uh, I've got a lot of things to catch up on, and here they are. Uh, most of, they're all mods. These are all mods done by the one Musab. These are, excuse me, all fairly current. They're the newer versions of these mods, so let's go ahead and check them out. The first one, jeez, I don't even remember what it is, hold on. My goodness, I'm bad at my job. Bad. Okay, hold on. First, I gotta figure out what this one is, because I believe it's another Sonic mod. I could be wrong. Oh, yeah. Here it is. Never mind. I figured it out. So, this is... Hold on. This is version 9.3. You can tell because he has also changed the sprites for the running animation. So the sprites for the running animation are different. That's the main hint that it's uh, that. Everything is a bit more polished. It feels pretty nice. Um, it actually feels like a PM Sonic, to be honest. Kills around 150, that's right. Each of these has pretty good knockback. That sour spot has some really good knockback now, which is nice, because then it feels like it. Um, it's a lot of good stuff here. All the links to the to the specific videos he has will be in the description below. I'm trying to think. This mod is pretty good, though. Everything feels very well. Oh yeah, that's right. He changed it to where the uh, up sm up charge hitbox. It only has two hits, just like Smash. Well, just like PM Sonic, which is really nice. It's got about the same amount of knockback as it, too. How did... Okay, I asked for a forward tilt that time. Oh, well, um... Actually, the only thing is, you... Uh, one Musab, you downgraded the, uh... Downcharge knockback by a lot. Let me see. That seems about right. Let me just see how much damage it will take. Because I know it's past 100. Let's try 130. Oh yeah, it's, it's at 150 now. And that's all the knockback it has. Okay, so besides that, everything else fits. Everything else is actually done with the mod, actually. The mod is pretty much complete. Which, if you really need to, you don't have to rely on the down charge all that much. He has so many other kill options, such as his forward air, his down air, his up air. He's got so many kill options, it's kind of nice that you didn't make the... Uh, down charge just like everything else because then it leaves more open for combos actually because if my controller would work you go into down charge into if it will work down charge into forward forward it i'm sorry i wanted to say something but my controllers i'm playing on my laptop again and forgive me for ever trying to play Smash on a laptop, because 
Goodness gracious, everyone knows that's gonna be okay. I can't do this. I can't do this now. I don't even know what that was, but my leg was inside of you and nothing happened. The knockback is pretty good, though. Knockback for the, uh, uh, whatever that was, was pretty good. Oh, yeah, neutral air. You got the knockback on the neutral air. Perfect. Oh, my goodness. It actually worked for once. That, believe me, that was not the game. That was just me because I'm using this. A laptop for this. Uh, but anyway, next up is his Tails one. It hits his version 3 on his Tails edition. So let's see what he's done. Ooh. So one I showed before was his version 2. So that's interesting. I think this, he said, was from Sonic Fighters. That was my fault. I had more jumps and I didn't use them. It, it looks like something that Sonic Fighters would have used. This is actually a very good mod, though. That's one I'm going to be using. I gotta get used to playing Tails again, though. Yeah, the recovery wasn't too bad from that. That's a pretty weird-sounding hitbox, but it worked pretty well. Okay, so that has a sour spot too, which is interesting because I like that because that sets up for a lot of combos. I like that. That's that's really neat. Goodbye. But yeah, there's a lot of stuff you can do with Tails, which is really cool now. So go check it out. Uh, that's gonna be all for that one. Next, we have also his newer... Did I ruin the recording? No, okay, uh, something just went off and, like, freaked me out for a moment. Next, we have his newer, uh... Newer Sonic mod, which is... It's, a uh, Sonic Fight... There we go. A Sonic Fighters mod, which is really cool. There's two versions of it. We're going to check each of them out. So... So for... I didn't look at all of the uh, videos, so I would save a lot of it for, like, new stuff for myself. So we'll check out and see what happens. The neutral sprite is actually pretty good. It looks like he's about ready to fight someone. I love that walking sprite. I don't know why, but that walking sprite looks really awesome. Running sprite looks pretty cool. It looks like a lot of adventure stuff I've seen. Ah, I see he also has the back air. I still find it weird that the forward air projecta projects you forward. My goodness, he saved me. So, I believe he was telling me that it's similar to, but it's not to his, uh, this is different from his classic Sonic. Not completely, though. There are a lot of things that remain the same. That would be the one Musab giving me an update on some stuff. Yes, I know. I know. I am sorry about the fact that I missed out on all this stuff. That was my fault, and I do feel bad about it. 
He's a pretty cool, cool guy, though. Back air and stuff feels really... The hitboxes feel nice, but it's, like, so weird to what I'm used to playing, because I'm used to playing Smash 4, and I was just playing that earlier today. But it actually feels really nice. Uh, so the grabs might be different. Okay, so that's the up grab. Ooh. That down grab has a really cool feature to it. <laughs> he claps you. That's funny. Whoa! Sonic does some crazy crap with his footing there. Let's check that out. Dang! That multi-kick of... Doom. So, your, uh... Up air has a spike box. And your down air seems to have a spike as well, or a meteor smash. Really cool mod, though. He's also created another version, but, uh, let's go ahead and check out the smash for this. The smash for the Tails one is just the same. It's, uh, Turbo Tails, which is really nice because he added the cape and stuff. Oh, I hate keyboards. Oh my goodness. The disrespect! <laughs> Oh, that was horrible. That was horrible. Okay. I'm done with this one. <laughs> that was horrible. That was disrespectful. Oh, that was bad. So we're going to put in this last set of data. That'll be it for this one. So this one, he considered his hyper mode, I believe he called it. So, we'll see what he's added to it. You guys wonder why I use Mario? Because he's a really good base character to use or to train against. Because he's about medium and weight and stuff. Okay, so. Oh my goodness. So. With everything, he hit stuns. That is OP as heck. That is OP as heck. My goodness, <laughs> he called this hyper mode. Holy crap! Okay, this is OP as heck right now. Up charge, thank you. There's so much you can do, that's so wrong. <laughs> There's so much you can do. That's mean. It's it's pretty cool for a, for a fun thing though. My goodness, those combos! <laughs> so bad and so evil, yet so beautiful. Well, there you have it. You get both the hyper and normal mode in the download link, which he has. And that's that's it. That's some pretty cool mods. Are you kidding me? You can infinitely hold these. 
You're joking! I'm glad I didn't leave. Let's see how far we can get. That is so that's so evil. That that's really cool though. It's a nice concept for Goof Off mod. So that's gonna be it. I hope you all enjoyed the video, and I will see you next time. Bye.